Today we are talking about uh, descriptive statistics. In your research work, you need to describe your, your data statistically, either for your thesis or paper or whatever. So, first of all, let's suppose we have two data sets, data set 1 and data set 2, okay? And here we have two, two descriptive statistic measures, namely measure of central tendency and measure of variability. As we see in the chart, we have descriptive statistic involved collecting, summarizing, and describing data through mathematical description or graphical description. In the mathematical des description uh, section, we are talking about measure of central tendency and measure of dispersion. Let's do that on Microsoft Excel. If we have these two data sets, now we can apply the Excel formula. So you can just type equal, average. Now we can select the first data set. Okay, enter. Mode. And here the mode for the first data set. Let's say this one is data set one. Okay. And here data set two. Now we calculated the average or the mean for the first data set. Simply just copy these two the right column and now we have calculated the, uh, the, the average or mean and the mod for the second data set. The first data set uh, average is 5.4, the second 9.6. And the mod here is 5, as you see 5 is repeated two times and for the second data set, it's 9, and 9 is repeated 3 times. Now, the measure of dispersion, or the measure of variability, mainly the variance, standard deviation, and standard error. So, now, and the minimum as well, minimum and the maximum. So, you can calculate the minimum, okay, minimum for the first data set, maximum. And the range, the range equal maximum by subtracting the maximum from the minimum. So now you have minimum, maximum, and range. So let's say the first data set is ranged from 4 to a maximum of 7 with an average of 5.4 and a mode of 9. And the second data set can be described as it's ranged from a minimum of 9 to a maximum of 11 with uh, an average of 9.6 and mode of 9. Now, we need to calculate uh, the variance and the very simply just uh, type in equal variance and here we can use var a for the first data set And the standard deviation, as we see, standard deviation is the square root of variance. So, or you can use the direct formula, standard deviation, stdevA, for the first data set. Okay, and just enter. And we can decrease the decimal point from this one. The standard error for mean here is the standard deviation divided by the square root of n. So you can just type in equal. Unfortunately, there is no uh, formula for the standard error, so you, you should do it manually. So equal the standard deviation divided by square root of n, and n here we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So you can just type in 5 enter 
here you can just copy these to the right column to calculate for the second data set. Now we calculated or we described the data statistically for both data set, data set 1 and data set 2 as a measure of central tendency and a measure of dispersion. If you need to, uh, to present these uh, graphically, just select this one, the data set 1 and data set 2, the average, and insert chart, select the type you want, and now you have a chart summarizing your data graphically. Here you can add as well the standard error bar by adding a chart element, standard error, and double click on the standard error bar. Okay, custom specify value, and you just select the standard error for the two data set plus, and the same for the standard error negative values. Now you will see the real calculated standard error for your data. Now you can customize the chart or just select one of these preset uh, chart uh, or figures on Microsoft Excel. Or you can change the color. And now you describe the data uh, statistically either mathematically or graphically. This also can be carried out simply by using the data analysis icon. Here you can just click on data analysis and select descriptive statistic and using data magnet just select data set 1, data set 2 and click OK, label in the first row and just click on check uh, summary statistic. OK. Now you have a full description for the two data set you can insert and shift cells to the right and just to delete the repeated. ligand here and you just minimize the decimal point to an acceptable value so now you have a, a, a full description of your data mathematical description mean standard error median mod and the minimum maximum sum if you want to compare between both you have it here so you have the same value now you describe by using the formulas or by using the data analysis uh, uh, icon and describe uh, uh, statistically by using the graphical description. Thank you. Bye.